Teach me grappling. What's up, guys? You didn't get that, did you? Okay. Um, Elijah. Yeah. He's here. You had a question? Yeah. So I'm not good at wrestling. I don't know anything about wrestling. But I was, I was asking a question about if you are wrestling someone bigger than you, what would your strategy be? And then I, what happened was it turned into a very basic uh, technique setup for a single leg. And uh, again, is it only for big guys? No, it's for everyone. But I kind of was giving you a setup that I think is easy to learn. And it's a great way to start. And I've been doing a lot of these videos for beginners out there, but it's great for everyone. It doesn't matter if you're advanced. You, There's advanced people that don't know some of this stuff and it might tweak you a little and make you better. So let's do a video. Teach me grappling. All right, so check this out. When you tie up, like, Elijah, how much you weigh? 260 probably. Okay, I'm 160, so you've got 100 pounds. Let me show you guys. If, if we grab each other, and he's on the inside, which he is right now, and he's trying to push me around and push, like, I can't, and when I try to get away, if he wanted to push me into that wall, he could push me to the wall, go ahead. See, now I'm trapped against the wall. Just by knowing inside tie and tie ups matters. So watch what happens when you start pushing. Now I'm on the inside, push. See that? Now all of a sudden I look like I'm strong, but really it's just that I'm on the inside. And he can go inside too. So if I go inside, you see now, you see how my elbows, my el I just tried to shut you down, elbows. And now you could go that way. And then we're, we're, we're battling, right? Yeah, now, you see you went for underhook? Go. And I circle out. You see? So I'm controlling insides with the thumb blocks. Okay? Now, I can't do this forever. I could, maybe. If he gets tired, you get a little tired, huh? Pretty tired. Now look, I push my opponent. He's obviously pushing me back because he doesn't want to run away anymore. And what I'm going to do is, we're not going to talk about the jockeying for inside tie anymore, but I wanted to show a little bit of that. Like, first, learn to dominate the inside. Most people don't even know this. So they'll let you. They'll let you have it. Dominate the inside. Now watch. One of the hands, I'm going to do a drop. Grab over, inside hook. The other one, stay on the inside post. Inside hook, inside post. Inside hook, inside post. Double post, double hook. Double post, double hook, post. Get it? One hook, one post. This one's a pull, this one's a push. If I push him, I watch my hand, I pull, I step this way, and I pull his leg. You can look at the forward now. I'm pushing. Now I want to make him step. So I'm going to step to the side and pull. Push him and reach over and pull. Push him, pull. When I pull, I push the other side as well. So there's a steering wheel effect. And then I also move my feet. So look at my feet. See? If I want to pull his right leg. Okay? In the beginning, you can step back like this. Like in the beginning. Because you're just learning how to maneuver your opponent. So I can step back like this. But what I'm going to do when I really go for the single leg, I'm going to make the guy step. And look at the difference. I didn't step my right leg back. I kept it in the front. So now I'm closer to the single. Here. See it? This one's the post. So I'm keeping him away from me so he can't stop me from coming in. And I step behind his leg. I place my head into his chest, below his head. I don't duck my head down. Keep your head up and lower your level. 
here. Then all I'm doing is I'm just pushing to get his leg up. Now his leg's in the air, okay? So I pull the guy, I push, I get a little energy. Now he's got some energy, so watch when I pull. I'm not gonna take this leg and step back. I'm just gonna step to the side, and now I'm ready. I've twisted his shoulders. See how I twisted the shoulders? I step and I grab. Now I'm pushing as I get to my leg. Now, I have a leg. I don't like to pinch. If you guys pinch, you have a narrow base. I turn my light body sideways a little bit. I'm pushing like this, no hands. Try to put your leg down. See, I'm not really, what I'm doing is I'm wedging this knee behind his thigh. So when he tries to put his leg down, it ha the only way to do that really is to turn your back to me. You see that? If you turn your back, you can get out. But if you face me, look what's happening in this wedge. See, I'm, I'm, I'm controlling his leg, I'm not even holding it. It looks ridiculous, but it works. But what do I do if the guy tries to turn him around? I just take his back. So if he tries to turn and run to get his leg out, you go to go behind him. Now I'm here, I pushed him. I push. See my lean? He's pushing back. Now I just step forward and pull and run the pipe. The big men fall down. Sorry, Elijah. But guess what? When you fight those big men, you're gonna make them fall down. Okay? So you try. First do the drill for me. Remember the push and pull? So he's gonna steer and go. Push and pull. Good. We got some sweat on the mat. Go ahead. Pull. Pull. Look at that. Good. Perfect. Pull. Look at how he's steering. Me. And then another thing is don't steer them with just your upper body. Sit your ass down in a chair. You know what I mean? Like kind of bring me down, sit, pull me into the floor. Go ahead. When you start hearing those heavy feet, you know you're doing it right. Pull me like this, like up. Like same thing, but just don't bend, don't sit in a chair. Did you hear light feet? Yeah, yeah. yeah it was light. It was, they weren't very loud. Pull me down, go. That's what we want. Now go ahead. The other one. Now we got to get Elijah to step and shuffle his feet to keep his lead leg in front so you can go for the attack. I don't want you to step back. Step back. I want you to do this. Look at, I have my right leg. When, when I'm pushing him, it doesn't really matter what's in front in the beginning. But when I make the move, I step my left and I pull and my right leg stays in front. So now I'm ready to go. You see that? So it's a step back and then in. Okay, kind of like striking. It's like step back and then come in with a, with a jab. So he just got done with striking. So kind of similar. So which single leg do you like the best? Uh, probably on this leg. You like this one? Yeah. So you're gonna keep this one here. You're gonna push me at first. Push me, right? Push me. Yeah, no, no, double push. So I now push into him because he's pushing me. Now he's gonna make the move. He pulls this one, step aside, and now I stepped on your foot. You might wanna move your foot a little more. Move your foot a little bit more. Yes, yeah, but no, no, your shoulders. Keep your shoulders here, don't, you, you can twist me. Level change, but don't over rotate your shoulders. Go ahead. Just move this way and level change. Yes! Now he's ready. Remember your head right there? He's pushing, yes. Look at his position. Little bit sideways with the hips. His head is up. He's here. The arms don't even have to work that hard, okay? You don't even have to work that hard. A lot of people, give me a, like a nice squeeze of the leg and get your head close to it. Like this, no, no, like this. Like a lot of guys say, pinch. Oh, oh, yeah. Pinch it with your legs. 
A lot of people do this. Are you ready, big man? See that? It doesn't work. Now go. Look at Don't worry about the pinch so much. Get the lean. Yes. Yes. Now push me a little bit. Push me. You feel me? Push back. Step forward. Drag me to the floor. Not bad. Not bad. You got to do a little more pull. A little more pull. Okay. Watch when I do it. Okay. Here. And let me do the whole. Let me do the whole move. So I'm pushing you. I pull. I step. Pressure. See, I'm pressuring. Now watch how I just get out of your way. And pull your leg. There's more detail to running the pipe, but this is a simple one. The big men, when you have them pushing, man, you just got to get out of the way and that big truck's going to keep moving. When it moves, pull the leg, it's going down. Okay, here we go. So push, double push. Yeah, I'm pushing back. He pulls. Yes, beautiful. Now you're pushing into me. And I'm, put, I'm like, no, I gotta fight this. Now just step and pull my leg. Yes! Not bad, that was great, I love it. <laughs> okay? Outstanding. One day at a time. Yeah, no, I mean, we, we did this like one time before the filming, one time. And I said, we gotta get this on Teach Me Grappling for you guys. So you did, outstanding. Thank Thanks. you. All right, you got any advice for all the big men out there? Uh, what did you say? Just do everything David Goggins does. <laughs> Working on that. <laughs> yeah, everything. If you guys don't know David Goggins, you know, you just gotta, you just gotta keep working. Anyway, stay hard. All right, guys. Like, share, subscribe, comment down below if you want to help us out. We've got links in the description box. Click those links. You can always do donate to this channel through Patreon or PayPal or become a part of our YouTube membership. Thank you guys so much, and we'll see you guys next time with more great stuff.